morning, light up every moment, make my every dream come true. Oh, I can't describe it, took my tongue and tied it, sent my heart over the moon. It come fly away with me, imagine all the things that we could see. Yeah, don't you know that life's a dance, come take my Are we good? Cool. So, love is defined as a great interest or pleasure in something. Well, seeing as I was sent photos of Luke before you even met him, and I was given a full report after the first date, I think both of those things were checked. Oh, as deep as my soul can reach, and as far as my eyes can see. Love is also defined by an intense feeling of deep affection, which, as we're all standing here, sitting here today, with champagne in our hands, I think we can all agree that that box is also checked. Luke and Brittany's love has been felt far and wide, from the beaches of Ontario, to the mountains of British Columbia, to the streets of Manhattan. Our story started with ice cream in the rain, beach days, trivia nights, movie dates, movie marathons, an unbelievably long line for infinity mirrors, skating in Nathan Phillips Square, a Valentine's in New York City, a Christmas in Edmonton, a few months locked down in our apartment, and all the other moments in between. I've had the best time writing this story, but what excites me the most is we've only written the first few chapters. <laughs> If there's only one thing in my life I have done correctly, it was giving my heart to you forever. I love you more than a sunset in Grand Bend. I love you more than every flavor of ice cream, even on a hot summer day. I love you with my whole heart, with a passion that honestly can't be expressed in words, only in kisses, glances, and years of adventure by your side. husband and wife, you may now kiss your bride. However you wish to define it, let us raise our glasses to the love of Brittany and Luke. May your love grow and change, your interests flex and form, and your affections bend, not break with the tides of your lives together. To Mr. and Mrs. Hamilton. is you